Well, Fox 26 is your Gulf Coast Weather Authority, and all of our reporters are outside today. Yes. But it's safe. I mean, it's not safe, and it's right. really hot. Yeah, they're probably suffering out there. It is super hot, and it's just the humidity mm -hmm. and the air temperature that really makes it feel very oppressive, very uncomfortable. So that feels like temp well into the triple digits. So we're in a good spot, <laughs> to say the least. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is nice and comfortable in here. You need to find some AC if you can, because outside it is super steamy. Yes, we've got some sunshine with a few clouds mixing in, but we also have those heat index values into the triple digits that feels like temp in Houston right now, right at 104 degrees, actual air temperature 93. So it looks like it's a pretty day, but once you spend about 20, 30 minutes out there, you are going to really be in the danger zone. So just make sure that you're taking it easy, drink plenty of water, try to find the shade. Better yet, find a nice, comfortable building and enjoy that AC if you can. Not much heat relief even late at night. Those temperatures are still going to hang out right around 80. That feels like temp, though, is going to be near 110 for many of you once again for tomorrow. In fact, there's not going to be much relief as far as precip is concerned. Only isolated showers and maybe a brief thunderstorm possible over the next few days. You can see a little bit of rain popping up right along Interstate 10. That's going to be west of Sealy and Katy over towards Columbus, but there's just not much rain to go around. Of course, it is summertime and maybe you're getting off work early. Maybe you want to hop in the car, roll down to Galveston, enjoy some beach time. Conditions at the beach looking a little bit better. Water's slightly choppy, but we've gotten rid of that super high rip current risk, but that UV index extreme. Don't forget the sunscreen and make sure you are still careful if you're going to get in the water and try to go for a swim. It is still going to be a little on the dangerous side any day, so just use caution. As far as our overall weather pattern, high pressure building in to our west, so that heat dome will be our big weather maker basically for the rest of the week. So with that heat building in, that means we have a high risk for heat illnesses, heat exhaustion. Certainly keep that in mind. Try not to spend too much time outdoors during the afternoon. There is that heat advisory for our inland spots, including Houston, that now has been extended through tomorrow evening. Check it out. Heat index values around 109 to 110 for the next few afternoons. That's in the danger zone. So we'll likely have that heat advisory extended once again for Thursday. Super steamy all the way into the weekend. And it looks like we'll keep those rain chances on the low side around 30% as we go into next week.